If you were to divide the animal world into good dads and bad dads, mammals would not impress. In less than 5% of mammal species do males provide any direct care of their young. For example, marmosets groom, feed and carry their infants piggyback. Golden jackals obligingly regurgitate food for their young. And humans are also in that small wedge of the good dad pie. But most mammal fathers are deadbeats with a love em and leave em approach. In birds, though, attentive care of the young by both male and female is the norm. In 80 to 90 percent of bird species, the males share the duties of nest building, incubating eggs, and feeding the chicks once they're hatched. In fact, research shows that some birds are capable of mental feats comparable to those found in our closest primate cousins. Birds teach, learn, solve problems, and they parent. In woodpeckers, for instance, females and males relieve one another during the day, but the male alone incubates at night. The anhinga goes through extraordinary lengths to feed the young. The snake bird of southern swamplands turns its whole mouth and neck into a kind of feeding tube to efficiently deliver partially digested fish down the throats of his chicks. This intimate fatherly involvement in raising young may well date from dinosaur days. Not long ago, scientists found evidence that males in some dinosaur species were the ones caring for the egg clutches. Today, some modern feathered fathers even master the role of the single dad. The male cassowary of New Guinea and northeastern Australia, for example, is a flightless species that sits alone on the nest for about 50 days, never leaving it and drinking and eating next to nothing until his chicks hatch.